you know, because I, I, I look at it and I'm like, well, you know, maybe, maybe we can silence him after this. You know what I like to do? I like to walk up in that office, grab all those things. Yeah, spit on them. I do a choke on the white woman. Straight up, straight the white woman. Just <laughs> randomly <laughs> picked her out the crowd. <laughs> you know what? I forgot about you. that. <laughs> you know what? <laughs> it's like, oh, wait, wait, wait. What's happening here? <laughs> wait, no. <laughs> wait, no. <laughs> I just... <laughs> Hey everyone, support our Patreon, which helps us to continue bringing you our live streams, videos, and podcasts while bringing you new content such as exclusive live streams and animated shorts. Like I said, people, there are some movies that I haven't seen since they were out. And I'm talking about from the 90s, close to when we started doing this. Mm -hmm. I think one of the first times that you started doing this with me, because I, I was I had been doing this about two three years uh, before Martin came on right. when we were doing cable access, doing the movie review thing on cable access, and so some of these movies I haven't seen in almost thirty years. One of those movies would be Jingle All the Way, and I remember so little about this movie except I didn't like it. I haven't seen it since then. Now, you know there are some movies that <laughs> I've come around on. For, for years, I was, I was under the impression that I hated Demolition Man. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. People would actually tell me, man, you got to watch it again. And I say, I ain't got to watch <laughs> shit. Put these glasses on, Corey. Yeah. <laughs> I am a critic. I stand by my word. <laughs> and I watched that again, and I was like, man, I was, even, I was ashamed to say. Because <laughs> right. not only did I say, well, this is fun. But God damn, it's actually kind of smart in some parts, yeah, too. Yeah. I remember yeah, looking at this yeah. and turning my nose. This is probably using reviewing movies. Yeah. I was just like, what is this yeah. dumb shit that is beneath me? <laughs> hey, brother, you weren't alone. I felt the exact same way. I was a different asshole at the time. <laughs> now, what kind of asshole are you now? <laughs> More open-minded. Still an asshole. Yeah, this is all open now. Yeah, it's all open wide now. <laughs> Still an asshole, but a little more open-minded about things. I was an asshole who would not admit that I was wrong about anything. Now, I'll change my mind on things and find some other way to talk shit about you. <laughs> See, I'll get you for this. <laughs> I'm going to get you, bitch. Yeah, but get but you, now I'm going to focus on this part. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Are you okay in this area? <laughs> <laughs> so who knows, man? Maybe maybe jingle all the way. Because a lot of people said, look, Corey, how can you, how can you not like but love the long-awaited team up of the two big S's at the time Schwarzenegger and Sinbad people been waiting for this day as I said at the beginning of the show, I said for some people this was the Avengers before we got the Avengers this was people's Marvel at the time now we were supposed to talk about this right before Christmas but consider this sort of a belated Christmas gift to all the Toasties out there that were asking about this and who knows maybe it might be a gift to me too a 30-year belated gift where I did not know, I did not appreciate the joy I had at the time. <laughs> Let's go ahead and take a look at the trailer for Jingle All the Way. I like the Turbo Man action figure with the arms and legs that move. Well, if you don't get your ass away from me. <laughs> no, no, no. <laughs> you, you, you know, fuck them Darth Vader yeah. boy already. Yeah, I just, I just got in the house. <laughs> you can go sit your ass down. <laughs> let dad, let dad you know take what? a shit. It's, it's funny because watching this, I felt the exact same way. <laughs> just, like, just, just, just sit down somewhere. Just God damn it, boy. Yeah, yeah. Just just write it down. How about that? <laughs> let me get my medicine real yeah, quick. Yeah. Man, then you talk to me. Let daddy take a <laughs> shit. <laughs> Leave me alone. <laughs> Christmas comes, but once a year. No! A little <laughs> this has you, you. This was made in nineteen what ninety six. Ninety six. Ninety six, and it is very relevant for today. Shit, this is, this is almost tried to warn us. I mean, this is something. This this was made in nineteen ninety six, and it. And I'm not gonna say it predicted, but it definitely got right. This whole pattern of people going crazy. For things, well, it was it was relevant then because it was the same year that everyone went crazy. Everybody went crazy for the tickle me for Elmo. Tickle me Elmo, yeah, yeah. yeah. And, so, and and that shit was happening for real. So now we're getting trampled. Yeah. <laughs> so now this is almost like people back in the day looked at this and said, "This is sad, stupid, and silly." Now to that it was just for toys back then. Today, oh PS Five. Today, <laughs> no, it ain't even PS Five. Today is for three dollar chicken sandwiches. <laughs> yeah. Mm -hmm. 
cheap ass hamburgers, mm -hmm. anything. People, we had just, the, the movie really did tell us at the time, you know, you think this movie's bad, y'all are stupid. <laughs> Don't you talk about me being silly. <laughs> Shit, I'm a prophet. <laughs> Y'all should know better. I will say the movie's very relevant because I looked at how they were fighting over this doll and I was like, all right, you know what? I'll give them that. That is one thing that they nailed right there and it has only gotten worse today. Mm -hmm. Something else I liked about this. Man, I liked the beginning of this when it started out like with the opening credits. I looked at this and I was like, you know what? They, they really got this whole thing of... Uh, of nailing the Power Rangers, yeah, man. Yeah, that's what they were doing, making fun of the Power yeah, Rangers. Yeah, at the beginning of the day, making fun of the Power Rangers, I was like, oh shit, y'all got this down. Oh, I'm coming, Billy! I'm like, this shit is better than the real Power Rangers. <laughs> right. I was like, that's value, yeah. Yeah, at least I kind of get it. You know? right. Plus, you're looking at it, you're like, yeah, the fist that pops off and comes back, mm. this is totally selling a toy. Oh, yeah, right. hell yeah. Yeah. I was like, all right. I was like, I looked at this and I said, man, y'all getting all this right. This is gonna be, this is gonna be hilarious. And you know, say what you want up to about Arnold Schwarzenegger, but Arnold Schwarzenegger with this and even a couple other things, I was like, you know what? He's he's actually funny. Well, what do you expect? You're my number one customer. But don't you forget, you're my number one customer. Liz, hi, honey. How are you? You on the phone? Like what? what? <laughs> customer, my number one customer, <laughs> Mr. Jacobs. Wait, is it Jacobs yeah, or yeah. Jacobs? Mr. Ja Mr. Jacobs. Oh, shut up, Jew. The guy. We told you can't do it. You can't keep doing that. <laughs> You're my number one customer. <laughs> Come, what consumer? What? <laughs> Howard, where are you? I know Chinese karate class. You're my number one customer. No oh, shit! Oh, shit. <laughs> the <back. laughs> I love, I love. It's like, oh, where are you? I'm at work, bitch. <laughs> <laughs> where are you? In the house I pay the mortgage. <laughs> You're gonna be late for his karate class. Doesn't he have one every weekend? Yeah, every right. week. Yeah. Wait, I'm just gonna watch that motherfucker <laughs> chop wood. <laughs> I forget. Did I send the check for that karate class? Oh, well? that's right, I did because I'm at work. <laughs> Little Vader shows up, oh. <laughs> and he. And the thing Vader. is, because everything was kind of going cool, but he just as weird as he was in Star Wars. Sure is. Here you go, Mr. President. Mom, Dad, Booster. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that look like Eagle. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yes, the, the Turbo Man cartoon <laughs> on the television. I love the Turbo Man. <laughs> <laughs> I must have one for Christmas. <laughs> Father, 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 father. Must purchase me one. <laughs> well, and it's funny, I, Jake Lloyd has always been like, yeah, doing Star Wars, it ruined my life and it ruined my career. And you see him in this, you're like, I don't know how far that career was going to go, dude. Right. Like, once you stop being cute, this, this shit was over. Jake Lloyd over here, boy. I, I, you know, I forgot that he was in this movie, man. Yeah. yeah. Shit, I looked at this and I looked at how he was in this scene. I'm like, well, shit, he might as well be Damien from The Omen because this is a bad sign right here. <laughs> I will say this in this movie, he's actually he's pretty cute, man. No, he's very cute. No, he's a, he actually he's actually pretty adorable in this, and in a way, he does he does kind of have a point about his dad. But dad's not home yet. Now he's probably gonna miss me get my belt. He misses everything. Probably just working really hard. Shit! He's in there making yeah. out with the secretary. Yeah, partying, partying with his maid. Oh, man. <laughs> See, they, they set up to make you think that. I know. And that, that whole party's going on. He's the one guy working who's still. still working. No, he, no, he is. No, seriously, no. I, I know. When I saw that, I was just like, this motherfucker right there. But no, he's, he's working his ass off right there. He's the only one. He owns the company. He's the only one out there. He's still trying to make sure those last minute Christmas orders ain't. Mm -hmm. yeah. I mean, dads in the movies are always, you know, workaholics. Well, I recognize it, Martin. I got a problem. <laughs> <laughs> they always yeah, yeah, always but, workaholics. But, but, the, but the family, they likes having at home. They like having the, all the presents. They like having a, a goddamn turbo, man. Right, well, that, exactly. That's the thing. They always set up the guy. And this is one thing that this is the trope that I don't like. And they, this was a big thing in the 90s. Uh, that's that's, and I'm not gonna say it, it, it spoiled anything for me or ruined the movie for me. It did not, but you know, it's one of those things we have to set up conflict between father and son, and how we do that. And dad's working too much. Like, yeah. well, he, hey, he, you want Turbo Man, right? Right, right. And she's <laughs> calling over, going, "Where have you been?" He's like, "You know, you didn't ever finish that real estate class you said you're gonna take." You know, right? <laughs> you, got too. you know, that that was the thing. Watching this again <laughs> this time, I was like, "Huh, I didn't really pick up on this before, but." 
uh, him and his wife, they're they're close to getting divorced. They are. Because she is not getting his oh. back the way she oh, should. Oh, we're getting to that. No, we're, yeah, well, hold on. We're getting to that. <laughs> Believe me, people. This is... Oh, hold on. Hold on. Just hold on. And by the way, this little crazy-ass kid right here, I can see why dad stays <laughs> at work. Because I'm going to tell you something. This motherfucker's ill. This kid is... This kid is something... I mean, even for a movie kid, there's something wrong with this little kid, man. He is obsessed with Turbo Man. Every, every every time he turns his head, there's another Turbo Man thing over there. If he ain't watching Turbo Man the show, he's waiting on the commercial to come on. <laughs> waiting, on <laughs> waiting on the commercial just to watch Turbo Man the commercial. When he when he goes to his room to get away from dad, when he's in there, what does he do? He ignores him picking up a Turbo Man comic book. <laughs> I'm like, God damn. <laughs> what a fantastic four pillow. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Dad bought those. He has yeah, a Turbo yeah, Man. Yeah. Shit, when he when he when, when, he, wa- when, when he wakes up in the morning, this fool is eating Turbo Man. Cereal, yeah, cereal. Yeah. Cereal, Turbo Man cereal, boy. Never sure. And I'm gonna tell you, and he is slurping that shit down, boy. <laughs> Getting Turbo Man all over his pajamas. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. All, all over his Turbo Man pajamas. Oh yeah, that's right. He doesn't his Turbo pajamas. Man pajamas. <laughs> Look, we gotta get this kid instead of Turbo. Let's get him some therapy. Yeah. <laughs> he, you know they talking about they, they talking about going to the parade. He don't he don't want to go unless Turbo Man is there. Anyway, this year Turbo Man's gonna be there. He's Schwarzenegger's like, like frozen, this kid like, and his uh, goddamn Turbo Man. Yeah, he's, he's like, you don't ever want to go. Now you want to go to the fucking parade. Yeah, God damn it. Schwarzenegger's like, I, I got to put this boy in therapy because I can't take this shit. It's either him or me. It's going to be one forcing of himself to smile. He, even, and there's a point in the movie where Arnold Schwarzenegger even said, you say Turbo Man one more goddamn time. I swear. You ain't going to be allowed to get no fucking Turbo Man. You know, it's like what Turbo Man said. Look, he, <laughs> God damn it. He, was yeah, he, like, he was about to be like Rob De Niro on Goodfellas. Just talking yeah, yeah. phone. Yeah, yeah. Tear up the, tear up the phone move. Always keep your promises if you want to keep your friends. Enough. Enough. <laughs> en- enough. 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 <laughs> yeah, <who? laughs> That's when you know Arnold Schwarzenegger's mad. Enough. <laughs> Enough of this trouble, man, okay? I had it up to here with this trouble, man. If there's anyone I don't want to have advice from right now, it's trouble, man. <laughs> now you're going to get sad. Uh, Total man. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> and you can tell it's all that he's been through some shit, too, because you can see his clothes are all <laughs> You can tell. You know, he's got a look on his face like, yeah, I kind of fucked up. I should stop talking about trouble, man, a long time ago. I'm going to tell y'all, man, just right up front, I don't hate the movie. I... I actually had fun with it. It's still a terrible fucking film. <laughs> but I had, but instead of being but mad, it's fun. but it I had, fun. Fun. it is a bad movie. But that, there is one thing, and I and it took me back. I said, okay, maybe I don't even know if I said this in review, but I look at this and I know I was mad at this movie because I don't really get that mad, mad, mad at movies unless they are just awful, awful, awful films. But I said, okay, there was one thing in this movie that made me mad here, and I'm you know I was okay with the movie, but f- Ted, man. Yeah. No, Ted, Ted. Made you mad. Oh, yeah. Well, it's not even Ted that really made me mad. It's things around Ted that make me mad. It's just Ted, just his existence and what he, the, the, the chain reactions that he starts, what he does. Him and the people around him, What man. he's trying to do. Yeah, yeah, what he's trying to do. Looking at Ted here, Ted, and if anybody remembers this movie, Ted plays the creepy neighbor who... Apparently is fucking the whole neighborhood. Mm-hmm. Ted, I baked you some cookies. I was wondering if you'd mind taking a look at my porch light. And it just doesn't seem to be working, and uh, you being such a handyman. It's a neighborhood. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's a neighborhood full of horny hoes. I know. I know. Na- which, by the way, is not bad if you stick to the horny hoes. Yeah, but that's no longer a challenge for Ted. No, that's right, the thing. Right, right. Like, I hit that I, bitch. I, I, I've been it's there. a neighborhood full of <laughs> horny <laughs> bitches, boy. And ain't, and ain't nothing wrong with that. If you can stick with the horny bitches after this was done, I'll start to call my realtor and say, is there a place in this neighborhood up for sale? For real. And I'll tell you something else. 
everything that they're fixing is an analogy for their vagina. It's yeah. Like, oh, yeah. It's like, thank you for fixing oh, yeah. my life. Yeah, and even when they talk about it, he kind of drifts off into memory like, oh, yeah. 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 Uh, no, no, I mean, she's like looking that. down and she's talking about a porch oh, yeah. My porch light don't work and no he's, more. Yeah, he's, think, look, he's thinking about it too. He's like, yeah, yeah, I did tear that ass Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You say you read for this again? You just started walking again. So you ready for this again? You don't want to this, baby. <laughs> it's Ted here. Remember that last time? No, you say this is Ted. Yeah, right. That's why I don't work now. <laughs> I can get the neighborhood anytime, anytime. I want. Right. And I, I'm so tired of tearing up all this 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 ass in the neighborhood that I need a challenge. <laughs> let me mess with. Let me not mess with. Not just. Not only just a married woman, but a woman who is married with a guy who can beat the shit out of me. Right, exactly. With ease. <laughs> with ease. With ease. <laughs> who can beat Ed, me mercilessly. Because Ted don't care. Ted is putting it out there. Broad daylight creeping. Showing. I, just, I wish your husband would say something. <laughs> I mean, you know, just we can on the edge of some Weinstein shit with this. Right. Yo, yeah. No, no, no joke. Like, yeah, yeah, oh, yeah, man. <laughs> My motherfucker must name him Ted Unwanted. Yeah. I mean, it's like this motherfucker be just every chance he gets. It's as if once he saw there was a crack in the relationship, he's just like. Well, it's my mission to just stick a wedge in there, yeah, right. just and break that, crack that open. A bat signal came up when yeah. they got that, that last argument. He was like, "Oh, oh yeah. it's time to shine." Yeah. I wish it's, I could it's say it's that. Ted time now. <laughs> yeah, yeah. yeah, but Ted talk with y'all. Yeah. Yeah, Ted, come back to bed. Shut up, bitch. I'm out of here. <laughs> time for me to get this real stuff. Time for the golden goose. <laughs> See, I, I don't even think it's about. It's not about the wife. No. P- played by uh, Rita what, Wilson. Uh, Rita, Rita Wilson. Wilson. Yeah. I, forgot, I forgot the wife's name in the movie, but uh, Schwarzenegger plays Howard. And it's not about Howard's wife. It's about Howard. Ted is really living the fuck with Howard. Yes. It, it, Ted yeah. is living on the edge. Because Ted probably saw himself as, you know, the 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 uh, the gigolo of the neighborhood, the suave mm-hmm. guy, the the handsome dude. And then Schwarzenegger comes in. With the body and everything. Yeah, yeah. Right. He's like, man, this motherfucker trying and, to take my title. And he right. lives, Ted lives to fuck with Howard, man. <laughs> the moment, you think little, little, little Vader is bad when you get through the door, before you even get through the door, when you pull up from the driveway and get out, Ted is Ted's up there waiting on the roof, putting up putting up Howard's lights. Putting up your house. house. Yeah. house. Yeah. Hey neighbor. Ted. Oh, yeah, they're standing there. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Look at him. Look at him. Yeah, yeah. I'm, I'm telling you, look at him. He's, he's close to just grabbing his dick. Yeah, look at him. He's up there. He's up there. He's up there looking like a goddamn grinning gremlin. Look at him. Uh-huh. He practically waits for Howard to call so he could he could tell him, you know I'm a f- wife, right? <laughs> uh, Ted, I need to speak to Liz. Uh, could you get? Mm. Oh, Howard, excuse me, but your wife's cookies are out of this world. Yeah, that's gonna be her <laughs> vagina next. <laughs> 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 Answering the phone at his house. Yeah, Talking like, about, can you put my wife on the phone? <laughs> <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like he's supposed to be there. Ain't this about a bitch? <laughs> Well, he's yeah. like, can you put her on a, I, I got to interrupt you because, nah, yeah. nah. she sure suck a good dick. Yeah. Like, I mean, cookies right. are good. Hey, I know you like those cookies, but you know I was in the middle of asking you something. Yeah. Right? Right. I don't give a shit what you got to say. <laughs> yeah, but you know, I'm, uh, yeah. I'm eating your wife's cookies right now. Yeah. <laughs> and you ain't. <laughs> you ain't, you're right. You know, think about it, Ted's got like a, 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 a 10 point plan. Like, yeah. all right, I'm going I'm in, the, I'm in the driveway. I'm on the roof. Yeah. I'm in the kitchen with the cookies. <laughs> oh, he's working and his so way. you know he's gonna be. He's closer and closer to that oh, bedroom. Yeah. He's working his way. Oh, your wife's in the shower. I can go get her for you. <laughs> yeah, <he's> like, oh, <laughs> well, hey, you told me to. <laughs> <laughs> she, she, gonna need, she gonna need a towel anyway. So let me go ahead. <laughs> what the fuck? Man, fuck Turbo, man. Ted, Come on, whoop your ass. Ted, Ted, Ted got no shame. <laughs> he can go get her. And a, and a lot of nuts. He's spreading around the neighborhood. Yeah. <laughs> your wife is on the list, yeah. Howard. Just so what you expect me to do? <laughs> you can have her back when I'm done. Yeah. Even, <laughs> and I, that's where you got that 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 quote right there. Uh, put the cookie down. <laughs> mm. Oh, these cookies! 
put that cookie down. <laughs> nah, man. Nah, nah. Come get him. You yeah, made yeah, me put yeah, it yeah, down. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Right, if you were here, I would have to do this. <laughs> Eat these cookies. Shit, these Why don't you go on back to work? Yeah, yeah. Ted is a creep. All right, ain't nobody, ain't ain't, ain't nobody uh, uh, looking at him and saying he's not. And, and no, and they don't shy away from that. They don't make it no. seem like, well, Ted's just a, he's just a guy. No, no, <laughs> Ted, no, Ted's a motherfucker, man. Ted's a, com- no, Ted's a complete ass, man. Ted, Ted is a, Ted's a creep. Ted's well, they, 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 they take it to a buffoonish level too, you know. Oh yeah, but, but he's trying to be slick about it. That's right, <laughs> right. But the thing is, I'm not completely mad at Ted. That's why I say it's not just Ted. It's things around it. The Ted gonna be Ted. You know? Yeah, yeah, he gonna get we that ass. That. Yeah. Let, let a player play. Yeah, let, let a player, player play. 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 Shit, the whole neighborhood's enabled his ass. Right. So Ted gonna do Ted gonna do what Ted do. I ain't excusing it. I ain't saying it's right. And Ted, he needs his ass beat hard. But I ain't mad at Ted. I'm mad at Howard's wife. Yeah, I was yeah. mad at her too. And this is what made me really come out hating the movie the <laughs> first time. Uh, yeah, man, because <laughs> look, the moment that this fool, let me look at it over here. The, the moment this fool starts putting hands on you, you right. don't push him away. You say, "Bitch, I'm married. Go home." And you better hope I don't tell Big Ass Howard about this. <laughs> You got the wrong one. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Well, yeah. well, I wasn't mad at her about that because I was like, she knows how to handle this. She she ain't worried about Ted. It what 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 got me was that the the son is going like, Dad, you're never here. And it's like, it's the wife's job or whichever parent's job to kind of cover for him. And like, no, 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 you understand. This is what happened. Don't right. worry about it. Right. But he got that because he must have been like, Dad's never here. Yeah, I know, right? He ain't shit. I, right? Yeah, your dad. <laughs> Thing you know, is, tell him when he gets home. She, I don't even excuse for that. You <clears> nice <throat> than I am, because I'm like, you know this dude been on the prowl with everybody in this neighborhood. You know what he's doing. He does not need he doesn't even need to be on that porch. And she's in the pit. You know, not only does she not tell him to go home or don't touch me, she invites his ass in the house. In the yeah. house. Oh, That's what I'm saying. Invites thing. his ass in yeah, the he house. He didn't break in there. But shit <laughs> the, the, yeah. I mean, this is some vampire shit. He can't come yeah, out. I was just about to say that. I was just about to say that. I don't, yeah, like a I don't know, man. With Ted, I think somehow he would. Yeah, he's something. He put a trance on you, something. Mm-hmm. But man, no. Ted, Ted is in the house doing things that that families need to be doing. Oh, I, I'm sorry, Ted, but that's Howard's job. You know, he always puts the star on. He's adamant about it. Too bad he's not as adamant about spending time with his family on Christmas Eve. Why is he decorating the tree, any part right. of that tree? Right, the tree shouldn't even be up. Andy Paul, why is he in the house? Like he's gonna come home and be like, well, at least he didn't put the star on. No, <laughs> I'd be like, what the fuck is this shit? <laughs> yeah. You better done this by yourself. That's all I know. This I know man, y'all can't reach this. <laughs> this man's been trying to fuck you from the start of this movie. And he's up in your house. You know what he's about? No, man, this is some disrespectful shit right here. And y'all know it. And not only is she disrespectful, but I'm going to go even a step further. A lot of people are not going to like what I have to say, but she's a scandalous hoe, too. She's in front of him. Now, there's some things that you do to get back at your husband to get attention, but you do not pull the thing that she pulled right here in front of his face when you know what Ted do. All I want is to salvage what's left of Christmas Eve and go to the parade with my son. Ted, would you drive us? Of course. He's like, I'm yeah, right like, here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You, you, you don't do that. No, no you don't do Especially this. After he had, at, this is after he had been pulling all that shit. Yeah. Yeah. Yo, dick out and yeah. shit and all that. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm like, yeah, I yeah, right at that point, I was like, what are you doing? This is where I got mad at the movie. I was like, even for, look, even for a movie, this shit is ridiculous. And the thing is, I'm going to come in here and say something about her being wrong, too. And then women going to get mad at me. Well, nobody should ever have to go through this. Nobody should ever disrespect their husband like this shit. Yeah, you're right. And also, she could have just been like, Give me the keys. I'm driving him. I don't yeah, want you yeah. coming. I don't want you to go right now. I'm mad at you. I don't look at you right yeah. now. Yeah, stay it. out of my face. But give me the goddamn keys so we can go to the parade. And not people, Ted, can you drive us? She should not get in the car with Ted by herself. I know. Go no, anywhere. No one. He's just gonna be just all hands. Boy, and, and the thing is, she had a chance. She had a chance. You gonna say, "Oh, well, blame the victim. Blame." No, I do blame her. I blame both of them. Ted's a fucking creep, and she's stupid and disrespectful as hell. She had many a chance to get out that car. The whole time, Craig, uh, Ted just sitting in the car. Just, mm-hmm. While he's driving. <laughs> yeah, I'm going to get that ass. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. As, soon, as soon as he started looking like that, she should have tuck and rolled. At the, at the, yeah, exactly. Yeah, yeah, get the hell out the car. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> 
Motherfucker, <laughs> fuck it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, like Lady Bird. I'm sorry. Yeah. I mean, they are both to blame here. Because now she's going to sit up here. She's going to sit up here until the last minute. Now, don't look, she ain't that dumb. She ain't gonna do nothing to get to get back at Howard, cause Howard just pissed me off today. To get back at him, she get in the car with a fucking pervert slash potential rapist, <laughs> right. and and she don't get in it. She ain't gonna do nothing. Now we supposed to act like this is a heroic moment when she hit him over the head with a thermos of eggnog. There are lots of women who would give anything to be in your position right now. Well, I'm a lucky, lucky girl. Yeah, he, yeah. he gets this point and it's always worked well, so he's well, like, yeah. so, that's what I'm saying I mean, like it's worked before ten, ten, that no that's what I'm saying <laughs> it, it, uh, before he got with her he's done the same move with all these other wives and, and they've gone with it right I'm just saying I, I feel like he hasn't had to put in this much work to get it with the other women well like I said he wants that challenge yeah. but people he goes yeah. further all right. Every day barbecue remember <laughs> and you asked me how to marinate ahi tuna <laughs> Oh, God yeah. damn. Yeah, you're him. I marinate Ahi tuna. You know, nothing that's, sexual. That's the worst oh, build up story. I know. Ever. I know. Ah, he tuna. I'm about to marinate your tuna, I guess. <laughs> and Schwarzenegger about to pick that, pick up that car. Throw yeah, I know. Ass. Exactly. Fuck you too, bitch. <laughs> oh, here's the part where she hits him with the thermos. Oh, we're supposed to be like, oh, yeah, you, no. you show him. You shouldn't have had your ass in the car anyway. Enough talking. Go! <laughs> oh. No, Yo! you know what? Ted, now, Yo! Ted deserved that, and Ted deserved a lot more. A lot more. But this could have been avoided way back. Notice we haven't even got to Sinbad yet. And boy, it's true, I, this, is something I, 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 this is something else I forgot. I I, I liked his intro. Let me just start out nice. Right here. I, I liked his intro in this when they when they first meet each other, uh, which lasts to the power of a, a good 30 seconds. Last minute shopping, huh? Yeah. Not to mention relative sunny presence. I'm like, oh, here we go. Yeah. Yeah, he, he got him riled up now. <laughs> yeah, he's like, he's like, that's funny because the first couple of things he says is like, yeah, I'm with you. And it's like, but I really don't want to interact with you right. and just yeah, focus on yeah. life. And he won't shut the fuck up. I, love, like, I was oh, like, no. man, I was like, this is pretty, this is good, but you know, and he's getting ramped up now. He Where also sees going into his shtick. Yeah, too, yeah, yeah. His yeah, they, shtick. yeah, they letting his, uh, I'm just like, why are they letting his brother improv? To send back anyway. How many toiletry kits does a man need? Dear Santa, could you send me a bike and a slinky? No, your father's been laid off. He's like, is it racist if I punch him right now? <laughs> I mean, I don't know if I just said the N word. Maybe he'll stop. Boy, it, I, I didn't mind that because I was like, okay, we've all been there with somebody who strikes up a conversation. They get loud and they they are not the going to shut up. All they're just going to keep going. It's just, and they think they're funny. Yep. No, that's it's, why it's been worse during the pandemic. That's why <laughs> yeah. I, I let it. I let it go. I just say, hey, Human you know contact. what? You know, I, I get it. They stand in line, but it just it, people. That was less than a minute that he got rid of. Other than thirty seconds, and then he just keeps going. Man, where have you been? Don't you watch TV? We are being set up by rich and powerful toy cartels who's working twenty four seven. You know, at, oh, it is. It is because at, they go, "Ooh, Vexy!" Yeah. yeah. Sorry, now, at, at, at this point, all all the white people looking at him, they're just kind of like, you know, I don't want to judge somebody by a stereotype, but. It was this quiet until the one black dude got <laughs> hit. Exactly. But it this was, nigga don't need to shut the yeah, fuck up. Yeah, it was. movie. And they, they all stopping to look back like, oh, yeah. Honda. The black woman behind him was keeping her mouth shut. <laughs> <laughs> but the one black dude came up and he, and the, black, and the black was like, don't make us look bad. Yeah. Don't make me look bad, brother. Just be quiet. <laughs> it keeps all going. Seven, delivery mail so you can make an alimony payment to a woman that slept with everybody at the post office but me. You know, after this point, there, did, there does come some hope. You know, because I, I, I look at it and I'm like, well, you know, maybe, maybe we can silence him after this. You know what I like to do? I like to walk up in that office, grab one of those yeah. guys, and just them. And do just the white woman. Just the white woman. Just randomly pick out the crowd. You know what? I forgot about you. that. You. You're right. It's like, oh, wait, wait, wait. What's happening here? Wait, no. I didn't do it. Wait, no. I didn't do it. He just looked around. And he said, I ain't gonna choke these sisters because they'll beat my ass, but you. It was like it was like Mortal Kombat. Get over here. And everybody just watched him do it. And just, you can even hear people like, what are you, what are you doing? That fool snapped. Oh, he would have got shot. That fool snapped. Yeah, he just shot his black you know ass. what I like to do? I like to walk up in that office, grab one of those guys, and just chuck him. Oh, oh, oh. 
She like, where the police? The thing is, he just keep getting lied about. Look, I don't have a problem with Sinbad because I like Sinbad. I, I do. do. Too. I, I do. do too. People said they made a movie back in the day the, 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 uh, of us. Sinbad would at, back in the day. Sinbad would play me. <laughs> is what they said because you just as loud as he is sometimes. <laughs> Um, but I would like to think that I got a little quiet because this this brother just because I like Sinbad. Let's just say that I like you know I like everybody, but I like Sinbad. It's just that his improv is just it's not so much jokes. It's just being loud. It's being loud. Yeah, yeah and, and it's a, it's a lot of that. It's which a is, lot which, of that. Which is why I like him in this at the times when he's not improving, which is right. rare. Because, right, right. Because because but, but a scene will start because it's it's like something happens. They have a conflict and he's taken away, and they bump into each other later. And even when he's like, yo, man, that was crazy back there. That's, oh. that's me, me and you be friends. I was like, this is a rare thing. <laughs> it's like, is he serious? Is he not? But I already seen it, so I know yeah, right, right, he's right. up to. God, but, I know he wasn't because every, <laughs> every moment he got, it was just like, this brother ain't going to ever stop being loud. Oh, yeah, I understand you, man. I was good enough to talk to line, but I'm not good enough to be in your team. See, that's racism. Bitch, you just choked a white woman. Yeah. <laughs> we ain't talking about that, though. Bitch, just two minutes ago, you choked a white woman. <laughs> this is be, racism. I don't want to be around bullshit. Yeah, yeah. But here's the... <laughs> yeah, but that was that was ten minutes ago. Come on, yeah. right, right, right. Come on, man. What's a little assault between people who aren't friends? But he is funny every time he turns on him. Yeah, I do that. I do like the way he, every time he like he asks that they're gonna be together, then he's like, "Hey, fuck you!" Yeah, you know, that, 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 those did make me laugh. No, this, he, he, he turns on him quick. This this is a movie. Yeah, he does. If you ever if you ever thought that they were gonna be a team, yeah. no, and they, and, they, the and they fool you several times. Yeah, and they, they look, they fool you two ways. They fool you into in, in, into making you think they're gonna be friends and a team, and they fool you into thinking that you'll be seeing the gentle side of Sinbad, <laughs> right. and he'll be quiet. That don't ever happen. Don't fall for that. See, I never forgave my father. It was like, oh, okay, here we go. Yeah. Serious moment. Yeah. Remember one Christmas, I went to this one special toy. Giant to Peter, Giant to Peter. Enemy sighted. Roger there. Open fire. And uh, here we go. <laughs> here we getting ramped up. It, it's well, a brother, real toy. Johnny 7 OMA one man army gun. Seven guns in one. Count them. One is a grenade launcher. Three is an anti tank gun. I see Serious buddy. side of Sinbad with a guy can dream, can't he? Because you're going to get that in reality. You can see the, the script later, like, none of this is in the fucking script. Yeah, 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 let him go. Is that a real cut toy? Yeah, it's a real toy. Oh. So it could be in the script, but yeah, and like I said, I don't mind that too much. I they, even, they let him improv a lot. I even found, I even start to feel sorry for him because I realize why he was so loud, and that's because he's a drunk. <laughs> and me? Well, <laughs> I'm just a loser. Here's to you, Dad. Oh, no. <laughs> I, you know what? I laughed because I thought I thought Howard was going to console him. Yeah. And I was like, no, my son will not be a loud black drunk. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah when I end up like this motherfucker right yeah. here. I thought he was going to be like, oh, it's okay, Sid, man. But like, he's like, fuck this. Yeah. Well, you know somebody is a, a loser and a drunk when they're like, yeah, man, you see how they, they make us look out there. You're like... No, no, that's yeah. just you. Yeah, he looked at him. He's wearing about his son. He ain't worried right, about right, sitting right, back. Right, 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 right. right. Shit, yo, your life is done. Your life is fucked. My, my kid got to live. <laughs> Meanwhile, that's Jake Lloyd today, right there. Oh. <laughs> no, no, no. Uh, all right, now that's, that's right, the one that's fucked up. No, that one was messed up. Man. <laughs> Phil Hartman, that has no, nothing to do with this. No, that, that, no that, that Phil Hartman <laughs> thing, that was bad. No, that, 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 that was fucked up. <laughs> the heck? Talk to the side, too. <laughs> hey, put his head to the side. You <laughs> drunk ass postman. I forgot how much assault. Was in this movie. Oh, There's a man. lot of assault. Oh, yeah. There's tons like, of like, assault. Like just even rewatching it, because part of me was like, man, maybe this would be better with a real comedian instead of Schwarzenegger. But then there's so many parts, I was like, it could only be Schwarzenegger. Yeah, yeah. Because he's committing violence on a lot of people. Oh, they gotta have a moment where <laughs> yeah. you know the uh, Schwarzenegger steps up to some fools. Yeah. yeah. No, no, you like keep, those two dudes yeah. in the store that kept laughing at him. Oh, yeah. He, uh, man, uh, he, put, he got them correct <laughs> real quick. Yeah. You know what? We got plenty of Turbo Man's faithful saber tooth tiger booster. <laughs> They see how big I am. They still gonna make me look like this in front of me. Oh hell no! I gotta break the law, <laughs> motherfucker! 
<laughs> but later though, it's one thing. Look, those dudes kind of had it coming. He's, you know, he, and plus this is movie world, so no, they do this all the time. Ain't nobody nitpicking on that. But later, Schwarzenegger starts. <laughs> he starts vandalizing and breaking and entering. Oh yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, my. yeah, I got a madman in my studio and. Uh... God damn! Yeah. Help me! Yeah, he, he, he went full Terminator he there. Yeah, dude, all that was busy. Like, boom, 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 <laughs> Come on, man! You can't, you can't, uh, with everything he he had to go through to get there with that child the whole time smiling at him, you didn't feel that frustration of give me that shit. But, yeah, he, I but he did that shit out in public where everybody can see it. Everybody can see it, man. He saw he assaulted a child. I want y'all to keep in mind all these assaults and violations that he does. I'm going to come back to that in a little bit. I tell you though, I will again. We'll give it to the movie for being weird, man. For mm-hmm. being weird, um, it's it's stupid, it's goofy, but it, man, you you you'd be hard pressed not to laugh at the, that 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 crooked ass Santa scene. Oh yeah, <laughs> and bootleg Santa that they got. In there. The, the whole way they roped him into it. Oh yeah, yeah, <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. straight up New York swindle. Yeah, they brought him to a sweatshop or a oh, swag house. Oh no, no, don't don't open it here. <laughs> yeah, yeah, don't open it here. <laughs> they, that yeah, Jim Belushi. They, yeah. yeah, yeah, Jim Belushi. Man, they showed that in the trailer where. <laughs> they, they conned his ass. They, they got. I'm sorry. They got him good. This is a shell game. <laughs> yeah, they, they look like Santa was a crooked ass Santa just sitting yeah. in the middle of the mall. Like, hey, yeah. bud, come here. Yeah, I got <laughs> some. Looking for a turbo, man. <laughs> Forget it. I'm not gonna sit in your lap. Of course, there's uh, some assembly required. <laughs> yeah. And the shit spoke Spanish. Boy, they, they spoke yeah, yeah, Spanish. Yeah, they spoke Spanish right here. And then when they got him in, they, they got him good. They got they, they lured him in with a song. <laughs> they, they gave him entertainment. Like a barbershop quartet. <laughs> <laughs> Man, that they got his ass good. It's hard not to laugh at that. And then when he wanted his money back, they brought out the ball set at the end of a video game. <laughs> yeah, they sure did. They, it was like a... It was like a, a <laughs> It was like the Santa Claus version of Master Blaster from Mad Max. <laughs> right. yep. They brought out the big ass dude and then the little one came out. <laughs> immediately, like, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh. <laughs> immediately went up on the head. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> It's so fucked up. It is. It is. Yeah, you get. <laughs> the cli- we say it's weird, but the climax is insane. And it's almost predictable. We know that Howard is uh, at some point is probably going to become Turbo Man. I wasn't thinking that parade. at all. Because <laughs> you see them at this parade and they talk about Turbo Man is going to be there and they're like, all right, shit, he's going to be Turbo Man. Yeah, ain't no yeah, ain't no strings on his. <laughs> yeah, no, yeah, yeah, no strings on the guitar. <laughs> but okay, you know it's predictable, and plus Howard is just confused. So it's just, it's, you know, it's not. That's not the one that I was, uh, you know, looking at and saying that's insane. The one I was looking at was was uh, oh. when when Sinbad became the mentor, <laughs> like because Howard is just. He's just, you know, he's a guy in a costume. Sinbad became a real super villain in this movie. He sure did. Well, yeah. well, he, but he was the whole time. Well, you didn't realize it until the end. Like he was when he kidnapped the like the the fake Dementor. <laughs> yeah, I got some for you. Yeah, got it with them. Yeah, caught, caught your slip, motherfucker. Yeah. yeah. Tied his ass up <laughs> like super villains do. In the cartoons, I always have long johns on under. Yeah, they say, ah! <laughs> <laughs> yeah, no. and dude, not that time. He said he beat somebody up to the clothes. <laughs> and he got out there and, and he, he was like a re- he was like he turned into Dementor, the real Dementor. He started like he started really beating the shit out the the the, the sidekicks. You know what? Nobody likes you, Booster. Oh, wow! 
Well, you ain't had to hit booster. <laughs> booster wasn't yeah, gonna do shit. Yeah, but uh, he was. You know, that's the thing. I was like, oh, he don't deserve that. But then it's like. Yeah, I guess nobody does like Booster. No, no one, no, nobody wanted that toy. Nope. The minute no. he was on the ground, all the kids came and started beating the shit out of him. They should have beat all of Why? They should have beat him. Let me find that. They should have beat this motherfucker too. They should have did. They just started beating the shit out of him for no reason. They just started beating the shit out of him. Feel like you said. Oh, hell. It's going to stop in his ass. Come back and just a skeleton down there. Yeah. Like, just a bunch of blood on the floor. Yeah. <laughs> a bunch of ground. Blood, he, blood and fur and bones. Yeah, brother, as soon as he hits the ground, Lord of Flies come up and start fucking with him. Yeah, sure did. Man, Booster didn't do nothing to kids. Who's Curtis Armstrong? It's the Booster's like... Oh, you, he was Booger in uh, Revenge oh, of the Oh, yeah, oh, yeah. And then my man starts... Uh, <laughs> He starts chasing. He actually he kidnaps the kid. Yeah. And starts like he kidnaps the kid. Starts chasing them on, uh, up high, high, uh, high buildings, putting the kid's life in danger. Like, bring your ass here. <laughs> and uh, meanwhile, Schwarzenegger, he ain't no better. He's flying around, damaging property and almost killing people. Let us pray. <laughs> They shouldn't have been at the parade. <laughs> yeah, yeah, exactly. <laughs> Try, trying to stay at their home being black people. What's, yeah, wrong, with what's them? wrong with them? How, dare they, how anyway. dare they black people that try to own shit? <laughs> 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 so they're the only ones with sense. They ain't out there at the parade. That stupidity they go, going on yeah, out there. Like this. At least we're safe here. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, shit. Shit. They looked out the window and saw Booster get his ass and like, nah. <laughs> you don't stay saw Booster get his yeah. ass Yeah. Man, tell me and you know that glass cut people. So this goes to show you some parts where the movie is dated. And I ain't, I'm not even saying that in a dated way like fashion or, you know, or, or trends at the time. Nah, they, they just got away with certain jokes like the, the, the Chinese the, yeah. restaurant joke. Yeah. But then there's certain things like you just, shit, if you thought, you know, look, we already got accused of being insensitive for Phil Hartman. I know. Now, there was a certain time you couldn't do anything, and, they, and, it's, and it's, it goes around with the cop. They have a cop in the movie, which I thought, all right, he's kind of funny in the beginning. Yeah, Robert Conrad. Besides Conrad's. the alphabet. <clears throat> a, B, C. Backwards. It's like, oh, you, 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 fuck, you know, we've all had that asshole cop. Yeah. That is oh, done. Yes, because I was even watching that. It's like, they play it as like a joke, but they do that for real. Yeah, yeah they do. Uh, is that Jim West? Uh, yeah, Jim West. Yeah, and then they, of course, they get into the thing where, oh, okay, he's back. Well, okay, we're doing the the running gag of the cop, where whenever Howard messes up, it's the same cop. Officer, you broke my little mirror. But after See, that, that's where Howard fucked up. I would have yeah, just drove off. Yeah, just I wouldn't do it at him. <laughs> well, I was like, somebody knocked your bike off. I was yeah. just picking it up. Like, he shit, didn't, I no, he didn't care. That. He didn't care. Like, but well, then, but the thing with the cop now, the, the, the cop got on my nerves. But they did something with the cop that was interesting. The cop got on my nerves because they did that bumbling Looney Tunes gag with him. You know, whenever he hits something, like, oh, Robert Carran. Yeah, I know. <laughs> and then they blew, and then they blew his ass. Now, up. now that was some Looney Tunes. Yes, yeah, yeah, it was. Yeah, he had a black face with it and everything. Yeah, he did, he did. The only thing he didn't do was oh me, oh my. Mm -hmm. Nothing but a Harmless Christmas package. Oh. Yeah, he just looked at me now and get that job of Mr. Yeah. Johnson. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Straight up picking any on their ass. Yeah. Direct quote from Illusion Coffee, so, by the way. Of course. And now the thing with this that I thought was kind of interesting is that this is before 9 11, September 9th. Sure. And this is, uh, I mean, I'm September 11th. September 11th. <laughs> I'm thinking my birthday. So this is for uh, September 11th. You know, when uh, the, the World Trade Center and is also before mass shootings like we had today. And mail bombs. And mail bombs. Well, no, it was, it was after mail bombs because they had the, I think, uh, the Unabomber. Oh, but Unabomber had already. Unabomber had already oh, been that's around. right, because that's what makes the joke. It's like, hey, I'm a mailman with packages. Any one of these yeah. could be a bomb. That's the thing. You could get away with Unabomber jokes. You could get away with, uh, uh, you get away with, uh, with, with, Mass shootings in the sense that people at the time, for some reason, people work for the post office. They were going oh, crazy. Right. Going, 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 going postal. postal and going in and shooting the workers. And they, they made fun of that here. Back up. Because I work for the post office, so you know I'm not stable. Now, <laughs> yeah. today, I don't know, because today you can't get away with 
bomb jokes too easy like that. You can't get away with mass shooting jokes yeah. like that. They're making fun of people with with mental problems, and that's no, there's nothing funny about that. Are mm-hmm. people who are you know victims of this? They, mm-hmm. They're going then. How do you think they'll feel if they see this? You know, and it's like so. Yeah, you know, so yeah. There's a lot of stuff back there. Was, hey, different time, y'all. Different time. So there you go, folks. <laughs> I, well, my verdict, of course, without having to give a rating, and it's, it's some bullshit, but it's fun. You know, it's it's. I had I I've turned around in the sense that. I can watch this. Uh, There's still some parts in there where I get irritated, but ah, you know, and since I've been doing these bad movie reviews, I, I can see how I have fun with this too. Come on, can it really be bullshit if you had fun and, and got so many yes, laughs? Yes, because I've given so many fun bullshits. <laughs> yes. Oh, you ran out. Yeah, <laughs> I to, kinda... went to the coupon book. It's like ah, oh, I got no more left. <laughs> got no, I got one left for this one right here. <laughs> so yeah, folks, there you go. Yeah. Jingle I mean, all the way. It's, still, it's a movie that whenever it's on TV, I will watch it. I, I, if during the holiday season. I had a blast re-watching I, it. I think it's fun. Yeah. 